Wild story out of Santa Ana overnight. Several people were taken to jail after a fight at a laundromat turned into a violent carjacking. CBS 2's Cara Finstrom is live where it all started. Cara? Yeah, this ended with a teenager beaten up and a man stabbed. Neither of them are believed to have life-threatening injuries, but business owners in this complex tell us all the violence is disturbing. I just worry about my wife, you know, because she's here uh, by herself. Mike Caldas owns the flower shop right across from the laundromat, where investigators say a fight between teenagers last night quickly escalated. Police say one young man was being beaten up and called his mother for help. She rushed over to get him. We believe that the suspects followed our victim and his mother into their neighborhood, and a multiple people got in a large altercation. Investigators think one of the teens then pulled out a knife and carjacked the mother. She wasn't hurt, and her expedition was quickly spotted by police, who stopped it and arrested the three teenage suspects inside. At about the same time, police say a man who they believe was stabbed during the incident walked into a hospital. He's expected to be okay too, but he's under arrest. Based on the video that we've seen from the laundromat and the investigation, we believe that individual is the instigator of the original uh, occurrence. Now police are looking for the son of the woman who was carjacked. He disappeared as police were making those arrests. He may think he's in trouble. At this point, he appears to be a victim. We really need to talk to him uh, and you know find out his side of the story. Now, I did speak with a relative of the teenager that police are now looking for. He had no comment on his whereabouts and said at this point, the family doesn't want to talk.